Welcome back guys. Today we'll see how to run the model in the Raspberry Pi. I think you have already downloaded this inference graph. Just put it to the Raspberry Pi and extract it. I have extracted here. So download this model.zip which is given in the description below. Right click and extract here this also. First open this, go to the research, then scroll below, search for object detection, then click it. After this opening the object detection folder, object underscore detection folder, just copy the inference graph here, overwrite, overwrite, apply to all existing overwrite. Okay, so you can see here so you can see here inference graph folder is copied and our model is here inside this please make sure before exporting this inference graph.zip tensorflow version of the raspberry pi is same as while exporting the inference graph otherwise it won't work it will give an error please remember that so after copying this Come back to the research folder here, just copy the path, open terminal, then type cd space, then paste the path here to the research folder, click enter, it will go into the research folder, then you need to type this, if you are doing this in raspberry pi then you should copy this and paste. If you are doing in a PC then you should copy this in and paste. Just paste it here. If it comes like protocol not found then you should do sudo app get install protocol dash compiler. Click enter. Type Y. After that run this, after this type python, I am using python3 so I will type python3 resetup.py build then python3 setup.py install If it comes like this, then you should do sudo sudo python3 setup.py install. It will install now. After this, cd object underscore detection go into the object detection folder. After this, minimize this, then go search for object detection folder here. You can see here cam.py image.py and video.py so first cam.py will open the main camera if you have any camera in the raspberry pi or your laptop just before opening 
you need to make some changes in the file number of classes equal to how many classes if you have i have two classes in the line number 33 and save it and also in image dot file number of classes i have two so it is correct if you have any number any other number you can just change it here okay and in video dot file number of classes equal to two. this is also in my case it is correct and scroll below this is a name of the video file win.mp4 you can change this if you want in image dot file also just scroll below to line 75 in img dot jpg is the name of the file you can also give the path here and in the cam dot file zero is the first camera and one is the second camera likewise and save this let me close this i'll run this bit dot file so in object detection folder i'll run video dot file i'll type python 3 python 3 video dot file and click enter So you can see here for video dot file with dot mp4 is there. Then for image dot file, this is the image I have given. Let me show you detecting this. Python three image dot file. Here you can see the detection. I'll close this and even this. Likewise, if you have anything to detect with camera, you can run the camera dot cam dot file. So this is how you train and detect the model. Thank you for watching. See you later. Bye bye.